Welcome to my new series, how to make your own stop motion video. In this series, I will take you through 5 steps so you can learn how to make awesome stop motion videos yourself. You can either make it to impress your family, show it to your friends, or even create your own YouTube channel. Personally, I recommend the last one. As I said, this series will be split into 5 episodes. In this first episode, I will tell you how to start when you are going to make a new video and how you can write the script. In the next episode, I will show you how you can create your own scenario. In the third episode, I will teach you how to place your camera right and make it take nice pictures, as well as how to create smooth animation. In the fourth episode, I will show you how you can put your pictures together with free softwares and make the overall video look the best as possible. And in the final video, I will teach you how to add sound effects, make an intro and complete the video. When I have finished this series, I will launch a contest where you can submit your own stop motion video. The top 3 videos will be shown on my channel and you will get a shout out. The number 1 winner will also get a friend request by me on Xbox or Playstation. Ok, so let's get into the first episode. The first thing you have to do when you are going to make a stop motion video is to make a script. If you don't have a script for the video, it will take much longer time to create and the video will probably end up being confusing and messy. Alright, so when you are going to make a script, you don't have to make it very complicated in the beginning. After you have become more experienced, you can start making more advanced stories, but in the beginning it is best to keep it simple. That's what I'm going to show you in this video. When you are making a script, you have endless possibilities. Only your imagination can put an end to it. However, to make a story interesting, you need to create a conflict. If you make a video without a conflict, it will become pretty boring. The conflict doesn't have to be big, something small works just fine. So here you can see that I created a script. A Spartan drives down a road. Suddenly, an elite appears in front of him. The elite raises his carbine and starts shooting towards the Spartan. The water with the Spartan skids in front of the elite and the Spartan starts shooting. The elite drops dead. The water keeps driving. At the side of every scene, you can see that I added a description. This is to show from which angle you are going to take the pictures from. You don't have to do this, but it will make it far easier for you. Also, try not to make a script for scenes you are unable to make. For example, if a character is going to enter a vehicle, you don't have to show that he actually enters the vehicle. You can just switch to another scene instead, and when he has entered the vehicle, you can switch back and everything will be fine. Alright, if you try to make a script like this, where you have a detailed description, it will be far easier for you to create your stop motion when you're going to start taking the pictures. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, comment or favorite as it really helps me out. Feel free to watch some of my other videos. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.